Joy Miner. How y'all doing? This is not a drill. This is a scorched earth, end of days, chastity about your daughter's bulletproof vest, your son's book of Eli, finally read Revelations page for page kind of situation. We have finally become the butt of jokes as a nation, taking the back seat that Rosa refused to be. All of democracy's flaws now reveal clearly beneath blinding light as blemishes in vanity mirror. Vanity clearly the motivation for the state of the nation and now there's nothing that can be done. Put your petitions away, bring your protests from the middle of streets and hold close to your communities because we need one another more now than we ever did before. Plant seeds within our youth and the soil of dilapidated places that were once barren of buildings and tend to them and in four years, they will bear fruit. Multiplying the mindset that died the day he took his place on the throne of the world. Flaunting his playboy model girl for all to see is evidence of American obsession with plasticity as attractive. This is not a drill. I can guarantee you that he will crack the mask that has been the American dream. Thump racism until it swells and rises to the surface like acne. Make us face the dysfunction of our family trees topple the hierarchy. Men didn't just start sexually harassing women yesterday. He was just unafraid to say he did it. Unafraid to admit his greed, ignorance, illiteracy, sexual deviancy, racist tendencies, welcoming us to eat scraps from the table of USA's true bigotry. We stand serving food and drinks to nourish their hypocrisy. Guest lists to include history's propaganda tycoons revealing Statue of Liberty's haggish face seen in full reality with crow's feet and buck teeth, Confederate flag wrapped around uh, stringy matted hair, Uncle Sam extending stilts beneath table as he jungle fever sneaks hand beneath Mammy's hoop skirts while she cuts his meat. Rosie Riveter chained to slab's top as centerpiece, buffet laid atop her nudity. Stepford wife standing and waiting at bedroom door while Russian babes golden showering from the ceiling. Grandmama getting drunk on mint juleps keeping a lazy eye on the children, patting hand to thigh while black ninnies jigaboo jujuing on beats on front porch as entertainment for their offspring, dressed in black face and rags with gold teeth in their mouths and Jordans on their feet. Black buck hung in as pinata, noose wrapped around his neck in front yard's trees, waiting to be beaten to see what's inside. Their family antics films is reality TV. There is nothing that will remain unseen and the world is watching now. So our posers take a bow as Big Brother heirs to things that we once wouldn't dare speak. Be afraid, be very afraid. They will continue to harambe us in our cages, claiming protection of their union state. But to date, only ones who truly need protecting are we who be melanated, but we are the ones meant to survive. Been waiting our whole lives for this very moment, prepped for centuries for end of days, take all lessons from the motherland buried deep within DNA, pair them with lessons from the art of war and the walking dead. First law of nature, self-preservation training and you will be prepared. Then tuck head between legs and hallways like tornado exercises and kiss your ass goodbye. <laughs> because this, pres this presidency on the strong will survive. This is not a drill. I repeat, this is not a drill. Welcome, my dears, to the Trumpocalypse. Mm. Woo! Okay. I got it made, um, Zazzle.com. <laughs> See, I got my name on the back, too. <laughs> Um, I mean, if I'm going to play the game, might as well wear the jersey. <laughs>